Stop! Stop making so much noise! We need to keep this video quiet! We can't have Minitune see it! Why you ask? Well, because today, we're looking at 7 Piggy glitches that Minitune never fixed in Roblox Piggy! A lot of the glitches in this video are near game breaking and will definitely give you an unfair advantage in piggy games. If you're gonna use them though, try not to annoy other players. We're not trying to ruin the game for others. Number one, falling through walls. Like a lot of Piggy and Roblox glitches in general sub, this glitch requires the use of the first and third person camera, and the way the game reacts when switching between the two. When switching from third to first person, what a lot of people might not realize is that your character slightly moves. People that are watching you can see this pretty clearly as if you're facing the other way. Your character will be completely flipped around. Using this trick, when in first person, you can shove your right up against a fence and then zoom out into third person. This way, you can turn your camera around without changing the position of your character. And by zooming into first person, you'll be able to flip your character around super quickly and fall through the wall. Dust yourself off some and boom! The next time you're buying Robux or Roblox Premium, make sure to enter star code sub at checkout. That way you can help to support the channel for free. No cash required. Number 2. No Crouch Vents One thing that catches a lot of Piggy players out when on the run from Piggy around the map is crouching through vents. We all know just how useful they can be, whether it be a vent that makes Piggy run all the way around a wall, or a vent that takes you halfway across the map. One thing is for sure, anywhere you can go that Piggy can't is a good place to be. Hence why some people even camp inside the big long vent in the basement of the house map. That way there's not even any glitching required. However, sir, we're not talking about vent camping with this glitch. What I'm talking about is those awkward moments when Piggy catches you because you've had to crouch to line yourself up with a vent, making yourself just slow enough for Piggy to catch up to you and oof you. Well, what if I told you sub? I had a way to go through vents without crouching at all. I know, right? All you've got to do is find some super small clothing items in the Roblox catalog and scale your character parts all the way down. Once you've got that all set up, you're able to run through the vents as much as you want. And you won't need a crouch, ever. Meaning Piggy is going to have to try a lot harder to not only find you since you're so small, but also catch you as you're running through the vent. One thing that you shouldn't have to struggle to catch, though, is our next video. By subscribing to the channel, you can ensure you never miss another Subs Blocks World video. Number 3 running through walls. We've already seen how you could fall right through locked doors, sub. But what if I told you that you could also run right through walls? No camera glitch is required. What it does require is a sneaky little program called Key Presser or any of the macro creating software. But remember to always be careful when downloading software online. Using a program like this, you're able to repeatedly pull out an item and put it away, like a key or a wrench or a hammer. Whatever it is, you just need to be able to put it out super quickly. And when you do, for some strange reason, you'll be able to run right through the walls with no further steps. You can even walk right outside the map, since this glitch is super overpowered. I just request that you don't use it too much. We've got to give Piggy here a chance, otherwise she'll never catch anybody. Number 4. Long Arms We've got another camera glitch sub. This time we're able to grab items without needing to unlock a safe. So now we can run through walls, get through locked doors, and even get items out of safes. By the end of this video sub, you'll be escaping maps in no time. You won't even need to find any keys or items at this rate. So let's get into it sub. Just like the door glitch, you'll need to get right up against the safe you're trying to reach your arms into. Once you've done that, zoom out into third person as far as you can go. But then, put 
push your camera against the safe. You should notice that your camera sticks to the safe as the game doesn't want to see you inside. However, if you keep trying and wiggling your camera around just slightly, eventually you'll hit a sweet spot where the camera goes into the safe and shows you the item inside. Get it just right, and you'll be able to grab the item from the inside. Hey, have you learned a new piggy glitch that you didn't know about before? Then make sure you leave a like in the video. Sub wants to know just how many new people he's taught glitches to. And if he gets a bunch of support, he'll make more videos just like this one. Number 5. Catching Glitchers it's all well and good knowing a bunch of glitches when running and hiding from Piggy Sub. But what about when you're on Piggy side? There's nothing more annoying than when the players are glitching to get out of your reach. Well, what a lot of Piggies don't know is that they can also glitch to catch other glitchers. It's a glitch war, and it's done by using emotes such as laugh and dance that cause Piggy to move in weird ways. For example, Sub, take the people that choose to camp inside the vents on Mall, making it impossible for for Piggy to catch them, especially if they're good at mousy. They'll never get caught. However, you can actually catch them. All you've got to do is line yourself up with a vent and then type slash E laugh, causing Piggy to do a laugh emote while holding W to walk forward. And if you've done it right, you should glitch right into the vent. If that doesn't work, try slash E dance too, causing Piggy to start dancing, and you might just glitch right in. Another common glitch is one where players will glitch out of the bathroom on house and run around on the invisible ceiling outside, seemingly as if they're floating. However, Piggy can make it out there too. Just run up the wall and try out those two emotes again. If you get it just right, you'll go right through the wall and you can catch them. Not so invincible now, glitchers. Number 6. Planning Ahead Here's a pretty widely known glitch sub, but it's super effective. It allows you to run faster everywhere, making it even easier to escape from Piggy. But if you want to pull it off, you're going to have to plan ahead. What I mean by that sub is that in order to complete this glitch, you need to do something in the previous round. While it may not seem like it, after escaping, your character gets teleported into a big black box. And while it's there, you're looking at things like menus and voting screens. So, if you crouch while escaping the previous map, you'll stay crouched while in the big black box. But what does this mean for you, sir? It means that when you get back into the next map, you'll still be crouched, except your speed will be as if you're standing up. So if you stand up, you'll go even faster, since you'll have your normal speed plus the difference between your crouch and run speed. Genius! Hey, do you know any glitches that we haven't mentioned in this video? Make sure to tell us all about them in the comments. That way everyone reading the comments can learn all the glitches there are to know. Number 7. Build Mode Bugs Although Build Mode is a revolutionary game mode for Piggy, it doesn't come without its problems. While letting any Piggy player build their own map, it opens up a wide range of problems Minitune probably didn't even think about. Like what about people that make maps that aren't even possible to complete? People could do stuff such as hide the key required for the door behind that door and not even include a wide door at all, so you can never complete the level. If I had to make a suggestion to Minitune, it would be to include checks like whether a wide door exists, or maybe every time a level is created, it must be completed by the player before it can be saved, just to make sure it's possible. Another problem with letting everybody create their map is that Piggy doesn't know how to travel around them effectively, because when Minitune creates a map, he can create paths for Piggy to follow. On build mode maps, Piggy doesn't know where to go and will often run into walls and get stuck behind objects or just get stuck entirely. Maybe in the future we could even get given the opportunity to create paths for Piggy to follow so she knows where to walk. Speaking of creating paths, you should create your path right to Sub's Blocks World. And the easiest way to do that is to hit the subscribe button, leave a like on the video, and let us know in the comments what kind of videos you want to see next. We'll catch you next time, Sub. Bye-bye.